Guys, up next, Cooler Technology Group, we've got Michael Mo in the house. Michael, how are you doing? Hi, Neil. Hey, I'm doing great. How are you? I'm doing wonderful. I'm super glad to have you here today, man. Great. Thank you. Thank you. Great so, to be here. Good. Glad glad to hear that, 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 that you're uh, uh, doing well. Um, would you mind, for the uninitiated, uh, giving us a brief introduction to your organization? Yes. Um, yes. So I would uh, like to, first of all, thank everybody. Uh, let me. Can you see my screen by any chance? Not yet. Not yet. Okay. So, so I'm going to add it now. And then so now people can see our little um, conversation in the background, a little behind the scenes. Um, so you, what you want to do is drag your presentation over to that screen. Uh, can you see it? So right now I see StreamYard. So I see that I see what like your logged in experience for the stream. Um, so you want to either click to the different tab or drag your presentation over onto that window. Okay, let me see. If I share screen, um, so can you see it now? Now I see us. Oh, oh, there it is. There it is. Okay, and just go into presentation. But beautifully done, Michael. Thank you. There it is. Thank you. <laughs> All right, Neil. Hey, thank you so much. Uh, yeah, so thanks for everybody for uh, being here on a <clears throat> on a Friday afternoon uh, before a long weekend for some folks that uh, leaving for a holiday next week. So I know it's past 5 p.m. on the East Coast time. Um, since uh, if you're on the East Coast, since you're not at the happy hour, but with us at the cooler presentation, uh, I figure you must be like me. You're on the more on the nerdier side um, into the technology. So I took the liberty and I will present a little bit of a nerdier version of our investor presentation today, um, which is in addition to the business slides, I will show a few slides on the demonstration of our product and our technology. And I'll promise you there'll be fireworks uh, in the presentation. Um, and quick introduction about, uh, you know, about Cooler. Uh, <clears throat> we come from uh, over a 30 year heritage of developing carbon fiber based thermal management solutions for space uh, and defense applications. Our products are trusted by NASA to be used on the Mars Rover 2020 program, um, uh, on the International Space Stations, and the numerous different aerospace and defense applications. Our mission is to take the space proven technology uh, and apply them to the world of lithium ion batteries and electronics to keep them uh, cooler, lighter, and safer. Um, our customers include the likes of Lockheed Martin, Airbus, Raytheon, and other commercial customers. Our technology target multiple billion dollar markets, which we'll talk about. And our, <clears throat> and our management team have decades of experience in technology product development, marketing, and public company finances. Quick introduction about the quarter management team. My name is Michael Mo. I'm the co-founder and CEO of the company. I've been in the semiconductor and the technology industry for over 25 years. Um, and uh, we're very pleased to announce that um, uh, Keith Cochran, who has recently joined Cooler as our president and chief operating officer, uh, he has spent uh, 24 successful years at Jabil, uh, most recently served as a senior vice president of global business unit responsible for their uh, $3.7 billion uh, smartphone manufacturing business in Asia. Uh, and he comes from a rich background in business operations, supply chain management, and manufacturing automation. Um, here's an overview of our products and technology. Our core technology is a carbon fiber matrix material that's very lightweight and conduct heat more efficiently than other materials. On the battery safety side, we have our uh, Hydra Thermal Runaway Shield TRS product that's used on the International Space Station to store astronauts' laptop batteries and the Microsoft Surface Pro safe without risk of fire and explosion on board. We also have the Lara ISC. That's a technology that NASA invented to test for battery safety for space applications. And we became the exclusive licensee and commercialization partner for them since 2018. Now we're serving EV customers, electric aviation customers, and energy storage customers with this product. Um, and then we also have our heritage uh, thermal management solutions, such as the ERA. That's a technology that's on board of Mars Rover 2020 to keep the Sherlock instrument operating uh, ideal conditions on Mars. Um, <clears throat> as, a, as excited as we are about the, you know, the space missions and programs, that's our heritage, we're more excited about the opportunity to apply these technologies into multiple billion dollar markets, such as energy storage, 
EV and 5G cloud computing infrastructures. To give an overview, um, the global lithium-ion battery market will hit about $100 billion by 2024. We believe battery safety is a critical aspect to, to enable this $100 billion market. Lithium-ion battery recycling industry will grow to about $18 billion by 2030, and transportation safety is a critical component of that. EV market obviously is going to, you know, it's forecast to grow very robustly from 3.3 million vehicles in 2019 to about 30 million vehicles by 2030. And, uh, need, you know, need, needless to say, to keep those batteries safe will be very, very important. And the global thermal management market and device market will reach over $16 billion by 2024, driving by the proliferation of cloud computing, AI, and upcoming 5G deployment where more data faster network and smaller devices are driving ever more increasing needs for better thermal management. Um, here's uh, give, give you a glimpse of some of the uh, some you know some of the products that we built. Uh, this is a product that we uh, built for NASA that's on board International Space Station to store the astronauts laptop uh, in there, uh, laptop batteries as well as their lap um, um, the tablets in there. It's on there since 20 uh, November of 2019. And, la and last year, we shipped more of these onto the ISS um, for the Microsoft Surface Pro. To give you a demonstration, I'm pretty sure some of you have seen the danger of lithium-ion battery. Here, um, uh, to give you an idea about how lithium-ion battery thermal runaway works, uh, we have four 21700 cells. We trigger one of the cells went to thermal runaway, and then it propagates to all the neighbor three cells. So these are very small cells, but you can see how much energy it packs. So when you have these events happening in your energy storage products or EVs, especially on board International Space Station, this is a catastrophic event. Um, here's our thermal runaway shield product uh, that's wrapped around 120 of those cells that you just saw. And we trigger three of those cells into thermal runaway. Um, into two of the corner cells and one in the middle. So with our TRS protection, you won't see any fire, you won't see any explosion, and you won't see any propagation of the catastrophic event into the other cells. All you see those smoke coming out, our technology wraps all that stuff and protect both the neighboring cells and the environment from fire, explosion, and the eject that comes out of the cells. Here's another demonstration of the battery going to thermal runaway uh, in a NASA high voltage battery pack. This is just one 18650 cell. You can see the the force and the uh, the high heat can go through a aluminum enclosure. Uh, we've, we've been working with NASA Marshall Space Center in developing our technology, putting our technology into future CubeSat batteries, small satellite batteries. In this case, we're showing a 16 cell battery pack that's with our technology in, uh, 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 with, with inside to protect the batteries uh, in between each other and also from the battery to the enclosure. So we'll, we'll draw a nail through the battery you see a lot of smoke coming out. That's the trigger cell going to thermal runaway. But you don't see any fire, you don't see any explosion, and you don't see anything coming out of the battery pack. So that meets the NASA safety requirement. Afterwards, you can see the battery pack. You have the trigger cell on top, but all the all the rest of the cells, they are fully operational, still, still intact, with our materials in between, and the enclosures are not breached. So our growth strategy is to collaborate and innovate with government agencies such as NASA, U.S. Air Force, Department, Department of Energy to develop cutting edge technology. Then we work with government and regulatory bodies such as the UN, FAA, DOT to bring awareness of our technology to be included in the future regulatory roadmaps. And then we apply this technology <clears throat> to commercial mass markets such as the energy storage, EV, and 5G uh, computing. We take a multi-pronged approach to serve our customers in different markets. Most of our engagements start with engineering, design, and testing services. Once we develop a customized solution for the customer, 
we offer the product for sale or is IP licensing for high volume customers. This allowed the customer to be to, to the flexibility of integrate our products into their supply chain and then make it more scalable and potentially lower costs for everybody. Um, it's important for our shareholders to, to, to know that Cooler's business model continue to evolve from being a component supplier to now providing more design and testing integrated service to our customers. In the next phase of our evolution is to provide total system solutions to address market needs. The scale up, to scale up is a system provider to, to, to be more quickly, efficiently enter these markets such as EV energy storage and hypersonic vehicle thermal systems. Cooler will actively seek partners to join, for joint venture, technology licensing, and other strategic partnership models. The goal is to leverage our thermal design expertise and a portfolio of IP to create market leading products, which will Cooler will take to market directly to capture more value for our shareholders. Some of the, uh, the customer and the, uh, and the partner relationships, we supply technology to FAA, Federal Aviation Administration to test for the battery safety for in-flight applications. Uh, the most exciting thing for us on, on that front for 2020 and 21 is our involvement with the Mars rover per per Perseverance that was launched last July and landed on February 18th on the, on the Red Planet. Uh, we also work with NASA, NASA Marshall Space Center on 3D printing battery systems for man and robotic space applications. On the commercial side, we've now we've announced a number of commercial customer engagements as listed here. The near-term commercializing commercialization opportunity for Cooler is to bring our TRS technology to energy storage, electric transportation, and battery transportation market. On the energy storage side, we announced our partnership with Volta Energy uh, since 2020 for grid and enterprise uh, energy storage products. We've been working very closely with them to testing for new safety regulations. We're very excited to, we're, actually, we're very excited about this project and we see great opportunity for it to ramp uh, in volume second half of 2021 and all the way into 2022 and 2023. Uh, we recently announced that Cooler became the official thermal management and battery safety technology partner for Andretti Technologies, which is the advanced technology arm of Andretti Autosport, founded by Michael Andretti. As part of the alliance, Cooler will establish a thermal management testing and design platform for high-performance battery solutions with the highest safety rating specifically designed for the Andretti's global racing enterprise. We also focus on co-developing in co-marketing battery safety and high-performance thermal management technology to serve the, the, the motorsports world and then um, uh, later on transition to the mass market EV applications. We'll be taking a page out of the playbook from industry leaders such as Tesla, Lucent Motors, where they start out with high-performance platforms like the Roadster and the Formula E platform. And we'll do the same with our partnership with the Andretti's, start with the highest amp of platform performance and populate to mass market applications. Here's a um, quick glimpse into our product development roadmap on the battery side. Uh, we recently announced our smart battery product for drone markets uh, a, a few weeks ago. This is the first step for our overall strategy of targeting adjacent markets, complementary to our existing battery safety and thermal management product. We intend to expand into additional e-mobility markets in coming quarters and years. And actually the next frontier is to utilize our carbon fiber technology for fast charging, lighter and safer batteries. Uh, we're exploring the configuration of these carbon fiber structure as part of a new battery, whether it's an improvement on existing chemistry or solid state chemistries. We start getting into the battery business and they actually into, inside the cell business with the ISC license from NASA and NREL. Uh, we'd really like to see our carbon fiber technology to play an important role in the development of the future of the battery. Uh, we believe that Cooler provides um, a compelling opportunity for investors. Uh, we've been trading on the OTC QB market since 2018 under the symbol KULR. Our goal for 2021 is to uplist to a senior national exchange. And we've been taking aggressive steps to achieve that. That include, we complete an $8 million registered direct deal at the end of 2020, which gave us a balance sheet uh, to scale up our uh, our operations. We appointed new independent directors uh, to meet uplisting requirements 
And more importantly, we've been investing all part of our business to position quarter for fast growth for 2021 and beyond. Our space proven technology, battery technology is critical platform play for multiple billion dollar high growth markets. We have a robust and growing pan portfolio that's both developed internally and also through license, exclusive licensing arrangements. Our business model evolution is to transition from a component supplier to an integrated design and testing supplier all the way to a total solution provider to capture more value for our shareholders. Uh, we exited 2020 with a almost 300% year over year growth in Q4. And we just announced our Q1 revenue growth uh, will be like 400% year over year. Uh, we're making significant investments uh, in all areas of our business from operation to sales, to R&D, um, to marketing. Uh, we look forward to a strong growth 2021 and hopefully on a senior exchange soon to attract more uh, investor share shareholders to join our mission to make the world's battery in electronics cooler, lighter, and safer. Thank you so much. Watching you present is like poetry. I think the last time that, that oh. you did one, one of our events, I said it was the best presentation ever. Um, uh, you were not kidding. There were fireworks this time. So, so cool, Michael. Um, Thank everything you. that you're doing. Um, the ticker is K-U-L-R. Um, <clears throat> guys, this is, as someone said, we've got someone here saying this is mandatory technology. Um, everyone here understands the the need for this and what you guys are doing and your existing partnerships are absolutely incredible um real quick question we, we got a couple here um but could you speak a little bit to the competitive landscape sure yeah um you know um it is uh we are serving new markets um you know kind of our growth strategy kind of you know maybe worth repeating is that we develop cutting edge technologies and then we apply to new markets. So mm. on the battery safety side, um, I think that we're competing a lot with internal development from um, a lot of the big customers themselves. Mm -hmm. um, we take a system, uh, holistic system approach. So um, we're constantly looking at new applications where being approached to uh, by new new you know uh, 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 customers trying to solve new problems that doesn't exist in the past. So. Um, the competition is actually time and also competing with their internal resources to how to solve these problems. So, um, yeah, that's, I mean, that's really it, you know? Excellent. Um, and any final remarks for our retail and institutional investor audience here today that you would like to leave us with? Well, I mean, uh, like, you know, uh, again, thank you so much for uh, spending uh, time with me on Friday. Um, we, you know, we'll continue to execute, um, we we are building our team, uh, Keith and uh, new members, Tony joining us. Um, and uh, we're expanding to a new facility that's 4X, uh, our previous facility. So we look forward to be uplisted on the senior exchange soon. And, uh, hopefully everybody can enjoy us for the, for the growth and the success to come. Thank you so much. Awesome stuff, Michael. Thank you so much for being with us and have a great weekend, my friend. Great. Thank you so much.